There's a woman over there all alone. It's unusual to find someone not in a group. No boyfriends to be seen in the area either. I think we're in the clear. All right, time to make contact. Excuse me, miss. Oh, hello. Can I help you? Oh, she's hot. Say, uh, you here alone? Yeah, and I'm so bored. I've been watching you, by the way. You've been trying to pick up girls for a while. Well, how'd you do? I see. You boys are cute. But you know why you didn't succeed? It's because you don't understand what a woman feels. Guess I can't deny that. You and the hat. You're way too wrapped up in yourself. Shouldn't you be thinking more about how to make your partner happy? Yes, ma'am. You and the t-shirt. You're the type that's stoic, but not very experienced with girls. Yeah, I guess that might be true. You seem like kind of a hassle, too. Like you're super logical about everything. <sighs> And you, with the long hair. Hmm. I'm not sure about you. <laughs> I mean, you're mysterious. Like, no one can ever tell what you're really thinking. You know what I mean? Oh, you're so smart. Mm-hmm. I think you're just my type. Hey, wait a second! Just joking. I like you a lot, too. Really? Want me to tell you what would make me really happy? Yes, ma'am. Could I ask you to help me put on my sunscreen? What? I mean, uh, you're all right with that? Of course I am. I have enough for you, too. Oh, oh man. I'm really sorry, guys, but I'm not passing up this chance. Would you two like to join, too? I'll give you a good deal. A deal? You know that sun in the sky isn't real, right? That's an artificial sun that got sent into space back in the 1980s. Huh? You didn't know? Turns out that sun sends out harmful rays that mess with your body's equilibrium. Normal sunscreen doesn't work. But that's where this special one comes in. And if you opt in right now, you can get three bottles for just 300,000 yen. Hey. Doesn't she sound kind of strange? Ah, what the hell? Don't just leave me behind! What? You're leaving? This sucks so much. What's wrong with you? I thought you weren't interested in picking up chicks. If I'm in a match, I want to win. I know what our problem is. You can't control yourself. What? Don't blame this on me. I'm just stating the obvious. Not like you scored either, sonata son. Why you always gotta be so logical? Even in front of babes, it doesn't make any sense. What did you just say? That's it. Leader, whose fault do you think it is? I won't accept a stalemate. It's either him or me. Yeah, that answer ain't gonna cut. Besides, 
Besides, what the hell do you... Oh. What? Do you see something? Talk about saving the best for last. Now that's what I'm talking about. Holy hell, she's cute. Yeah. Oh, man, this is insane. If we nail this, it'll blow our failures out of the water. How about this time? We try going one by one instead of all together. All right, I'm in. Okay, and let's decide the order. We'll go clockwise, starting with the wind. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors! Oh yeah! I win! Okay, I'll go first, Sonata sign a second, and you'll go last. Here it goes! Uh, hey. I notice you've been, uh, staring at the ocean. So, um, you here with anyone? My name's J Junpei. J Junpei? <clears throat> um, I was just wondering if you'd be down to talk. If you're not busy. I mean, it's more fun than standing here all by yourself, right? I am looking for someone. Uh, oh yeah? You are not that someone. Wow. You got shot down faster than I expected. She's a tough one, Senpai. <laughs> Don't worry about me. Oh, hey. Do you like the... Uh, motion? Is your question directed at me? Oh, uh, yeah. I mean, I like the ocean. I, you know, I heard something interesting about triathletes who train at indoor pools. Apparently, they get outperformed by athletes who train in the ocean. That information is irrelevant to me. Uh. <laughs> well, I won. I talked to her longer than you did. It doesn't matter how long you talk to her! <sighs> this sucks. I could cry. Hey, don't cry. Ugh, you're making me feel bad. Well, that's where we are. If you can't pull this off, I'm gonna be traumatized for the rest of my life. We're on the ropes, but it's not over yet. It's all up to you now. must be made at a secure location. Hey! What did you say to make her run away like that? Well, what are you waiting for? Go after her! This could turn into serious trouble. You gotta go tell her you're sorry. If you don't, we'll get all the blame. Go on. You can catch her if you hurry.
Now I am certain. I have found you. I have been searching for you. My highest priority is to be at your side. What? Are you freaking kidding me? What's going on? He didn't even say anything to her. There you guys are. What are you doing here? We've been looking all over for you. Um, what are you doing in the middle of the woods in your swimsuits? You have no idea what we've... Huh? Who's this? And why is she hugging you? Listen, we have a slight situation here. I'm sorry to interrupt your vacation, but I need everyone to go back to the house and gear up. Oh, that won't be necessary. We found what we were looking for. Mr. Chairman, what do you mean? <laughs> you had me worried. You can't just leave the lab on your own, I guess. Understood. Sorry for all the trouble. Everything is under control now. What happened to securing the tank? Oh, that's been taken care of. I guess, join us over here. Understood. This is I guess. As you can see, she's a machine with the form and face of a human girl. I am I guess. My objective is to exterminate shadows. I have been assigned to seize, effective immediately. No way. It's like she's alive. This is unbelievable. How can a robot be this cute? What a cruel world. Ten years ago, a plan was enacted to create anti-shadow weapons. A contingency in the event a shadow became unmanageable. Igis was the last one to be made. And she's the only one that still remains today. An anti-shadow weapon? Does that mean she has a persona too? Correct. I am capable of wielding the persona called Palladian. She suffered major damage in combat her first year out. And she's been kept in the lab ever since. I'm still not sure as to why she suddenly reactivated herself this morning. In any case, I hope you'll all get along. An anti-shadow weapon, possessing a will all her own. This is amazing! Uh, if you don't mind me asking, when we first saw you earlier, you were, uh, hugging our leader. Do you know him? Yes, it is very important for me to be by his side. Hmm. Maybe her facial recognition system is malfunctioning? Or maybe she's still half asleep. Very interesting. Hmm. Half asleep? Well, I can ponder this later. Anyhow, I forgot to mention. Did you know there are a wide range of recreational facilities you can use here? There's a tennis court, a pool table, and even a karaoke machine. Would anyone care to hear me sing? It's already the third day of our trip. It's too bad we have to go home tomorrow. I'd totally stay longer if I could. But I can't complain too much. You went through a hell of a lot here. 
Yeah, like hearing you and the chairman singing. I barely got any sleep last night. Do we have a mission at the beach today? Nah, it's nothing like that. We just came here to have some fun. Do you understand what it means to have fun, I guess? Yes, I am informed of the concept. Recreation is sustenance for one's mental well-being. Yeah, exactly! Wow, you sure know a lot about us humans. All right, let's take one last dip before we leave. Uh, wait, Junpei-kun, is it okay for Igus to go in the water? I'm sure she's fine. Oh, are you done already? It is best that everyone partake in this activity together. Deriving enjoyment alone is not the optimal method to have fun. <laughs> You've got some strong feelings on pretty weird things, don't you? But what the heck, might as well. We should join them. <laughs> Agreed. Enjoying yourselves. Quite a lot's happened during our time here, but it looks like we'll get to relax a bit today. <laughs> that would be nice. Sonata san! What are you doing? Come on, it's your turn! My turn? What are they doing? <laughs> Glad to see everyone's having so much fun. I've already told you what time the ship is arriving tomorrow, right? I'll probably head over to the port early, so don't be late. Okay, I'll let everyone know. We can get back to business once we've returned to the dorm. Got it. Hey, dude! banana son All right, I guess we should join too. I guess wait, that's not what water got me! Kun is down! Alright! Here's our chance for an all-out attack! Wait! Time out! Let's see if we can't think! You seem to be in great pain. You again. Shit, it's them! You mean those three? Ugh, they're freaky. Shut up! Let's get out of here! Why do they always run and hide at the sight of me? They're like back alley rats. <sighs> Beats me. Jin, give him the capsules. <laughs> Thanks. I'll pay you the usual way. Now hold up. This time, we'd like your payment in the form of information. Your acquaintances have been busy lately. I'm referring to their activities on nights when the moon is full, of course. They've spent a great deal of time in the tower as well. I wonder, why did they take this burden upon themselves? Hmm. You do know don't you? But you don't wish to say. Is it perhaps because... you're one of them? I'm not. I've got nothing to do with them anymore. Then tell us. 
I'm sure you'd agree these pills are more important than a group you have nothing to do with. <sighs> I don't know the details, but supposedly, destroying all those creatures will put an end to the Dark Hour. And that weird-ass tower will disappear. That's all I know, all right? You mean, they intend to eliminate the Dark Hour completely? Why would they do such a thing? To give up such power? Ugh. To destroy the Tower of Demise. Tower of Demise? Who wouldn't want to take out that damn thing? <sighs> Takaya. Yes, I know. my power again. Not after last time. Oh, hello. Yeah. Are my requests wonderful? Oh, my, how splendid! Morning. I request that you wake up. You have successfully awakened. Mission complete. Priority is to be at your side. Can you help us? She might come out on her own later. 
like she did in Yakushima. My name is not that girl. Please address me as I guess. while he was asleep. Unlocked the door, door took two, two minutes. minutes. That's unlawful entry. Didn't we tell you to stay in the command room at night? I determined that it is ideal to be on standby in this room. Is this a problem? What? Where is this coming from all of a sudden? If there is a problem, I will address it promptly. forecast report next up is the treasurer's report yes hey sorry but I was hoping you had some time once this meetings over we can talk up on the roof I'm sorry to drag you up here but I wanted to tell you cigarette butt incident is going to be dropped. It seems interrogating a student in the school raised a few concerns. I wanted to be student council president next year, and that teacher promised to endorse me if I agreed to help him. But I lost any hope of achieving that when I spoke up against him. 
Not to mention the student body isn't so fond of me. I rambled on about rules and fairness, but all I really proved was that I was desperate for power. understand why the president asked you to join the student council. You aren't just feeding me sympathy or empty words. You genuinely mean what you say. The system only works if you have people's trust. And trust isn't something you can force on anyone. When that teacher doubted you, I felt backed into a corner by a fool who simply had more power than me. I felt like the truth was being distorted lose a friend as a consequence. If it wasn't for you, I would have become a tyrant. So, thank you. Don't you dare repeat what I just said to anyone. I realize it's out of my usual character. I'm sure everyone would just make fun of me. Just promise, okay? This time, let's have a nice meal as we talk about our future battles. Or do you not care as long as you're the one who gets to do the fighting? Our future battles, huh? things first. Let's get some food. Hey, what's going on? Should we call somebody? There you are, Akihiko Sonata. Oh, you're the guys from before. Turns out you're pretty famous, huh? An up-and-coming boxer, that it? Time to pick up where we left off. Show me what you got. Kicking your ass is gonna do wonders for our rep. No way we're gonna pass this up. Champ or not, look at our numbers. You ain't got a chance. Boxers are tough, ain't they? What? You can't handle a challenge? You're welcome to join him, though, Pipsqueak. 
See? We're reasonable, right? <laughs> you said beating me with one rep. I thought this was about testing each other's strength. You idiot. I'm just gonna have fun kicking your ass because you're full of yourself. And who the hell cares about any of that as long as you win? Isn't that how you roll too? <laughs> so, you wanna go first or what? Get back. away from <sighs> running away is easy enough it's losing them that's the hard part still made for a good workout right that was some quick thinking by the way just what I'd expect from our leader I don't exactly like turning my back to an opponent but it doesn't matter in the end if I can't protect the one inside me. And being outnumbered increases our risk of injury or damaging our surroundings. What I mean is, you make the right call. I owe you. Hmm? It's addressed to me. It says it contains fruits, snacks, and beverages. Looks like it's from my parents. I'll take it to my room later. Yeah, it's probably because they think I'm a growing boy and all that. I haven't kept in touch lately since I'm so busy, but I should probably write back and thank them. I appreciate how much they care. This is a little too generous. Want to take some of it off my hands? And again, you'll hardly make a dent in this either. Good idea. Would you mind gathering everyone up? Oh my! Very intriguing. Everything is such high quality. I can tell just by looking. Your parents must really care about you. <laughs> At least you know how to behave in front of your parents, Nagihiko. Don't you ever have anything nice to say about me? My parents have been good to me. I obviously haven't told them about what we do here, though. <laughs> when it comes to being considerate of others, you're a heavyweight. Glad to have you in our corner, senpai. There he goes again. He sure look good, though. Thanks for sharing, Sonata-senpai. Take whatever you want. Going for that one, huh? You can tell. You have my thanks. That took care of most of it. I'm surprised they were so happy. I've really got to show my gratitude. To my parents and to everyone here. Well, all this talk about my parents reminded me of some things from the past. Like, why I'm here right now. I guess I feel like I remember my reason for fighting. Well, don't mind me. Let's just say I've got a lot of room to grow. The dorm's gotten so much busier. The orphanage used to be something like this, too. We all lived under the same roof. Just having casual conversations. I'd forgotten what it was like, but it wasn't so bad. I remembered after you suggested we share with everyone. Tell that to my parents. I really gotta repay you in particular, though. Or we'll never be squared away. Alright, it's pretty late now. I guess we should clean up and call it a night. What? Is there something there? This is... Yeah. 
No, this is mine. You won't understand what it means, but it's from a long time ago. Do you mind if I ask you something? You take on the role of our leader, and you're stronger than anyone else in your own right. That's more than just being talented. Where do you get that strength from? Oh, I see. You mean you feel motivated because you have people in your corner? Bonds with others, huh? That might be something I'm missing. Well, whatever it is, you've clearly got something that I don't. But being jealous or trying to copy you isn't going to help me. That strength is yours alone. I'm going to get stronger, but I'll do it my way. Sorry, we were supposed to be cleaning up. I'll take care of the rest. Things got so busy that I missed out on my chance to thank you again. Hopefully the food was enough for today. I'll invite you out again some other time. about the track team. Since you just transferred, you probably haven't heard about the Mioho Cup, right? Well, let me tell you. On August 2nd, there's a major competition for track and field. There's this guy named Hayase. Total speed team. We can't let him trounce us this year. We've got high hopes for you, so get ready to train hard. I'm gonna need you to show up from July 27th to August 1st. Don't go skipping school now. I've got a special training regimen in mind for you. ISA won't stand a chance. Competition's on August 2nd. Let's do this thing! 